ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದೋದ್ದಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣದ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ್ಯ ಪಾಸಿಂದಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮುಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಕಂಗಿ ಯತ್ ಪಾತ್ಮಹಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈಕೋಷಿ ಪ್ರೀಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಭಕ್ತಿಪದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವ ನಮೋ ನಮ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚನೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ದೇವ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರೋ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋ ಧೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟುಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಗಿರಿಂಚನ ಸರಣ್ಯ ಗೀತಾತಿಹಂ ಪುನಪಾಂಧವಾಧಿಭೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರಸತಿ ಚರುಣಾಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕುಶಂದ ಮುನಿ ಕ್ಷಟಾಯ ವಿಶ್ವರುಜೀತಕಮಿ ಗೋದೃಶದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸುಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರ ಕಮಲಾಶತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೋ ದ್ವಿಜವರೋ ಯುಗಧಾನುಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರೋ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿಥೋದಿಪುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನು ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರಭಿಭೂಷಿತ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನೋಂಗ ಮದಾಪಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಾಜಸ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಸ್ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತೈ ದಂಬಿ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಹರೆ 
धर्म प्रज्जित कैत्यवात्र परम निर्वासरा सतम वेद्यम वस्तव वस्तु शिवदम तपत्रोन्मूलम श्रीमद्भागवते महामुनीकृत किंवाईश्वर शो हृदय बरुद्धति पृथ्वी शुश्रीस्तत्न धर्म प्रज्जित कैत्यवात्र परम निर्वसरा सतम वेद्यम वस्तव वस्तु शिवदम तपत्रोन्मूलम श्रीमद्भागवते महामुनीकृत किंवाईश्वर शो हृदय बरुद्धति भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट वी ऑल जीवस दैट अकेत सत्य प्रवचन वी आर गेटिंग दैट वी हैव टू that transcendental uh, absolute truth in order to hear that that kind of courage and power that kind of courage should be there and power should be here to hear that absolute truth kodiya goshti pati tisila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami thakur prabhupad paramans jagat guru told that whatever our that in the transcendental world that unalloyed truth absolute truth this uh, that top most absolute truth of that transcendental absolute truth that we just need to hear it continuously and we just need to hear and uh, manifest in our life that we also speak also that kind of top most absolute truth transcendental truth we need to speak in front of others also the prabhupad speaking that we without any kind of vanchana and giving any kind of cheating propensity to anyone without any kind of reason we are not at all cheating anyone by that by not cheating anyone this all transcendental absolute truth that kind of absolute truth we need to speak in front of all of them that we need to speak that absolute truth in front of them the jeevas their actual mangal that is if they are getting that absolute mangal the jeevas that actual absolute mangal when it is done that kind of uh, absolute truth if normal person it is not at all getting that or they are not at all they are feeling very pain then the proper speaking that they we still we should speak that the jeevas we can get the absolute mangal that kind of absolute truth we just if very much uh, unhappy the uh, material people are becoming by hearing that but still you need to speak that absolute truth in front of them in this if someone actually putting this point that maharaj that by body speech and mind we just need to don't need to give any udveg to anyone so why you are speaking this deep prabhu is speaking that this uh, top more nishtur absolute transcendental truth whether the persons are not at all feeling uh, happy just by hearing this but still they are feeling pain by hearing that but anyhow you just need to speak this absolute truth that that just that kind of uh, udveg you are giving here this is not at all uh, applicable this kind of uh, that is not at all udveg at all that is the actual prema that is actual prema that is actually called the actual uh, work of a friend actual role of a friend that topmost transcendental absolute truth we need to hear and we need to digest that and that topmost aprakrit shabd brahm we just need to hear from the lotus mouth of pure guru vaishnav that is important we need to accept that how all the material so that all the material jeevas can get the topmost mangal and how they can get the necessary mangal how the whole persons of the infinity material world how we can uh, give them the topmost absolute mangal this kind of uh, consciousness we need to develop that is actually the work of an absolute sadhu actual sadhu that with full uh, st- st- firm and strong uh, resolution and 
firm determination at his own that and the other also you just need to do the mangal of both of them that is very much important only in this present uh, kali yuga that this not for uh, even for human beings that in and every time a factor and in every kal it's not that in present situation only only for human beings it is not like that that in each and every yuga and in each and every time factor of that particular yuga of each and every per jiva that topmost permanent mangal that for that you just need to put some lot of efforts that for infinity mangal of the absolute the jivas how they will get just that kind of efforts you need to put that that is very much important that in whatever place you are going that in this material world that in order to spread this material uh, uh, uselessness in all the four direction actually is matter so what you can do in that so that kind that kind of topmost transcendental nitya seva we have to get so that we cannot uh, come back from that uh, transcendental world and we should not come back to this uh, uh, materially material useless matter that topmost uh, uh, happy full of happiness that kind of a transcendental vaikuntha katha you just need to speak that you see this kind of place or a place is there where for infinity period that infinity anand you are getting that kind of just to try to go there that's why that under the, that under pure guru vaishnav they are actually speaking all the time hari katha from their lotus mouth that so that some mangal they can get definitely someone will get that that's why in this transcendental uh, that transcendental uh, absolute truth all those transcendental hari katha in order to speak to others that kind of acharan is very much important for us and shri satguru charan that kind of uh, uh, padashri is very much important and we all the time we have to do the aarti of them all the time that which guru pad padma for that by the creep of that guru pad padma that divine knowledge we are getting the vigyan that the vigyan who is donating that that guru pad padma all the time fraction of second we have to do the seva we have to do the worship of guru pad padma all the time whether we are in house or whether we are outside that each and every person you need to take of uh, each and every house person you need to take and you have to glorify your guru dev that is actually important that's why in bhagavad ji mahapuran that bhagavad ji mahapuran this shloka which i have already started with today they are also this kind of uh, that pati pratishthiti is there that vyas dev ko swami pad has just given us one promise what that this dharma that which dharma all the jivas are want wanted to follow that dharma that vedas are called general dharma loka dharma that ved dharma they are uh, called and samaj dharma mano dharma body the dharma all kind of different different dharma that thousands and lakhs of dharma are actually getting manifested but these kind of dharma by all these dharma the jivas are not at all getting that actual transcendental uh, blissfulness and absolute mangal they are not at all getting by this kind of dharma following that that absolute mangal this is no no kind of uh, that absolute mangal is not at all possible for the jivas What does it mean actually? That is in the Shrimad Bhagavat Ji Krantha, that a very serene and tranquil heart, that kind of topmost mercy, that Paramahansa Guru Vaishnav, that their dharma, that to in order it's already being mentioned there about their dharma, dharma, arth, kam, moksha, all these kind of things, that. all are actually cheating comes under cheating propensity there is no question of that 
and dharma and kaam moksha kaitya they are actually all cheating propensities no smell of that is there and that param absolute dharma atma dharma what actually written here agyan to mer naam ko hi koi job dharma artho kaam mukh adish tar muddhe moksha bancha koi tob pradhan jahan aite krishna bhakti hoy antar i was you understand the point what i am speaking that kaitav means ka cheating propensity that it is coming from avidya that agyantam and this all dharma artha kaam moksha these are all general conception they are all kaitav they going to you going to cheat yourself by all this that automatically in order to just make yourself cheated you in or you are just want to cheat yourself that's it and or you want to cheat yourself who is actually uh, responsible for that dharma artho kaam mukha adi isha tar mudde moksha vancha koi to bhula isme moksha vancha in this moksha vancha that kaitav is the top most that is the top most cheater and prominent prominent cheater from where krishna bhakti is getting uh, will not at all stay at all that so this kind of dharma this satyam sadhu ganu that all those satam pure guru vaishnav that kind of uh, prem that uh, all those uh, premik sadhus that that is the actual dharma bhagavad dharma is their actual dharma for all those premik sadhus that ava shila shila ragunath das goswami bad that proja is the charya of proja tat he actually speaking this same thing in front of us that normal conception of dharma arth kaam moksha definitely you need to throw this is the actual cause of your material bondage for what purpose you will do by attaining them so here actually it is being spoken that shruti gan by that whatever is written by the shrutis that whatever actually that kind of dharm which is actually manifested by shrutis whether it's dharma or adharm you don't need to do anything at all why because the dharma and adharm this both of them actually will just one become one kind of hanging uh, rope for you which we which gonna kill you so that shruti gun the actual and ultimate goal is what the shruti is what is the actual ultimate goal of them the actual ultimate goal is to just show the lotus feet of bhagwan that bhagwan swam himself just uh, accepting this point and speaking in front of us that all the vedas the topmost purportive or conclusive point is me to get my lotus feet that's why that bhagavad dharma atma dharma on on that that we need to f- uh, focus on that that uh, your own time don't need to waste that at all that kind of uh, transcendental the uh, transcendental time you are having all the time you just need to understand what is chit and what is achit and just don't waste your time in all these material rubbish talkings that bhagavad dharma prem dharma that uh, all the time you just need to uh, think of that and just need to do is to go steep of that that what ragunath das goswami pad 
as actually speaking about that raganuga pathway that rupanuga pathway he is giving us the instructions that by this kind of strict rules and regulations he is speaking Yeah. Yesterday we already have just uh, talked about this point that Gokaran Ji Maharaj also is giving this kind of upadesh to his father, and he's speaking. She is so nice. Actually, it is spoken. What actually spoken here? That he is speaking to his father, Atma Dev. That oh, father. That Bhagwat Dharma, Prem Dharma. That do you have to do the Anushila or you have to take the shelter of that Prem Dharma? What actually spoken here? The same thing Raghunath Das Goswami was speaking. Shila Bhakti Thakur has had Vigyan Vittik Vichari is giving in front of her. If someone is doing Purva Paksha, that if someone actually doing some Purva Paksha, then in that, definitely some doubt is coming in this, that, that we just need to throw the thumb just by taking the shelter of Krishna Bhakti, how Jeevas can maintain their uh, life, how they can run their life, material life, because Dharma and Dharma, that Dharma and Dharma, that it won't be possible to just maintain our life. That to maintain our life, it is uh, not at all possible. And the second point is that that this Radha Krishna, that Yugal Bhajan, we are actually, if we accept that Yugal Bhajan, then why, what, who is actually Shri Krishna Jitana Mahaprabhu? How we can understand Him? That what is that Shri Krishna Jitana Mahaprabhu Tattva? And the third question is there that uh, how we have to understand Gurudev that Gurudev how we have to accept Gurudev and after that okay Inside this, all kind of uh, uh, topmost teachings are there. The actual answer of the, all these doubts is that. Okay. That Shruti is by that that kind of dharma or adharma. It's totally prohibited, restricted to do these kinds of dharma and adharma. That Narottam Thakur is speaking. Dharma karma all people are doing. But they, what is their actual goal? They don't know about that at all. So, that whatever you are doing, that Narottam Thakur also writing in Kirtan. That Bhagwan in Gita also speaking the same point. I have told a lot of a lot of times this point. I have already discussed with you. Bhagwan speaking in Gita. What is speaking? That you see that I am I am not at all uh, whatever I am not at all ready to take all your good deeds and bad deeds because I am not at all responsible for that. You are more you are yourself responsible. I am not at all speaking. I am speaking. 
that all kind of dharma karma that all kind of karma dharma that general consumption which is there that everything they will just leave that that about dharma and karma just by removing that only then they will come to me arjun actually is thinking is that uh, just by doing dharma giving dharma then definitely i'll get sinful deeds no no bhagwan speaking no everything is my uh, my duty i will protect you from all this this is my actual promise to you this is my actual promise to you that 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 definitely i'm going to save you that only and only one bhagwan you just become sanagat onto my lotus feet so, so then in the shrutis it's already being shown that dharma and adharma nothing you have to do so definitely you won't get dosh in that yes no dosh will be there why because for normal common people that whatever position is there for them that whatever position is there that uh, his adhikar he just need to understand and the shruti guns that kind of dharm and adharm you don't need to do anything uh, with written in shrutis because all those human beings what they will do they definitely they either they will do dharm or adharm they will do definitely the human beings will do that they can't just stay uh, keep they can't kept quiet and just sit like silent so this all kind of uh, dharm and adharm what is uh, how to live his life by all those st- restrictions and prohibition that kind of uh, thing he, if this kind of restriction we will actually put for a dharm and a dharma then the normal human beings who have jivas won't uh, live like that in these prohibitions and restrictions everything you need to live everything you live nothing is required if we speak like this then all the other jivas then very topmost uh, bhakti you will get that and lot of barriers will come in the life of a normal person so whether they are doing dharma or whether they are doing adharma if he is not at all in dharma then definitely he definitely going to do adharma so this is the condition so definitely he will do adharma so what to do now that all the human beings if they are doing whatever they are doing that whether dharma or whether adharma that in the shruti it is written that if our samuday in a particular frame of time it is getting uh, uh, getting uh, restricted and prohibited in our life then we can't live our life at all that in our samuday sindhu also it is written so this kriti shat 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 the karma etc das ko swami has just prohibited it's not like that that kriti kriti shat the kriti shat the whatever kind of karma everything is prohibited it's not like that it's not like that that persons if they are not at all understanding if the person is not understanding उटनीउट Without discipline is very much necessary and essential for all those those who are already indisciplined, those who are already getting that transcendental path uh, discipline, that pathway onto the pathway of prema. They are going. Then that kind of discipline you just need to throw away your material discipline. Your discipline you just need to take in front of you. That Param Guru Vishnu. They are actually driving force is only prema. They are driven by prema. So I understand. So what they will do of your uh, foolish rules and regulations, material? What Shila Prabodhana Saraswati Pad actually speaking now very nicely. Kriya sakti. 
दान धीक धीगस्त विकट तो बस धीक है क्रिया सक्तान धीक धीक विकट तो बस धीगस्त ब्रह्म अहम बदर परिफुल्लान जरो मतीन किम इतान सोचान विशर समत्यान नरक सुन न के सांचित देशो भी अहो हो मृत्यु गुरु मरी तावद ब्रह्म कथा तावद मुक्ति पदवी तावद न तिक्ति भवे तावद चाप विशंकर तमेते न लोक वेद सिद्धि तावद मितहां कलकलो हैं तावद सस्तो विदाम मिथो कलकलो तावद सस्तो विदाम मिथो कलकलो ना नाना बहिर वत्मसु श्री चैतन्य प्रियजन जावत न दिख के चल तावत ब्रह्म कथा तावत मुक्ति बन तावत चाबी विशेष करे तमाते नलों को भी दस्ती दी जो लोग डिसिप्लिन को ज़्यादा दोस्त वो एक्चुअली गिविंग इम्पोर्टेंस तू डी मटेरियल डिसिप्लिन ओके डिसिप्लिन इस गुड that uh, I am not all speaking that discipline is bad. Discipline is good. But that discipline, which uh, on to the Paramahansa God, God Kishore Das Baba Ji, in his seva, it's one kind of barrier. That kind of material discipline, we need to throw it away. That kind of discipline, that our Paramahansa God Kishore Das Baba Ji, in his life, bhajan life, is by putting one kind of barrier. Then what to use of that? We just need to leave that discipline, material discipline. Discipline is that, that is one unwise man feeling that those who are un those who are actually use knows actual utilization of time all the time and even fraction of second in his life they are they are ever about it that how to serve krishna because if an, even one second you are actually doing misuse then it will become topmost vipatti for all of them you understand, you understand the point so that in the logic uh, samaj that rules regulation discipline courage this definitely is good it's not at all bad at all that i'm not at all speaking it's bad i am speaking it's good but that those pure guru vaishnav that topmost vaishnav uttam vaishnav whose life they are actually driven driven by prema that if you you can actually put some kind of barrier in to Ishwar Puri Pad. Oh, you don't go here, don't go there. Why you are doing this? So then, for him, it will become one of one kind of barrier in his uh, transcendental absolute seva. He will become chandal. If you will speak at Madhavendra Puri Pad, are where are you going, Madhavendra Puri Pad? Huh? What you are doing? That uh, you know discipline is there in your life. Are foolish number one. You are just like foolish talking. Are his life already is actually driven by prema. This prema, that actual language and actual conclusion is this only what he is getting practically. Hmm. Foolish number one. So, all by all those shrutis, that dharma adharma, that is actually not given by because those who will give Definitely one, one, one kind of hanging grow for them. And uh, what is the actual uh, uh, work and role of all the jivas, human beings, they will do dharma or they will do adharma. That these both things are actually strictly prohibited. And if we are actually coming on that conclusion, then even one fraction of second we can't even stay at all. It will become very much heavy for us to be like that and Raghunath Goswami is going to ask Bhaktivinoda Thakur is speaking all that don't no, no need to do anything it's not like that he was out of two tips one is Vigya and one is Agya that Agya ignorant Jeevas why because inside his heart restlessness is there and he is become he is very unstable and he is uh, very difficulty we have very dif- with full difficulty we need to, to know how to just uh, get out of the bondage because uh, bonded jivas cannot get them out of their bondage and they cannot maintain them at all those who are ignorant jivas 
without any kind of discipline in their life they cannot go at all agya jeev that ignorant jeeva without kind any kind of uh, uh, strict rules and regulation he cannot move at all and if he wants to make his own mangal then that lakhs millions and millions of a mangal he will actually ask to come you understand the point jo swayam karna chahta hai that who himself want to do that is a mangal pratha how it can be mangal that's why shruti smriti all kind of dharma and adharma that kind of uh, division of uh, duties and activities is there that about that we just need to be very careful for those who don't have any those who already got the relationship of swarup gyan that already they are getting into that swarup gyan that for them external all these kind of restrictions are not done necessary at all that for them shruti ganon mein that the shruti guns that atmati krishna bhakti shruti nirguru seva that this kind of instruction is given there that all those shra, shraddhalu shraddhalu people what is shraddha shuddhi ro vishwas krishna bhakti ko inde that that shraddha shabd means that firm determination and firm confidence so this shloka is there nobody actually putting any kind of uh, efforts i don't know in which what kind of drowsiness they are actually moving sahajiya people what they actually have written they haven't put any kind of uh, uh, concentration on this it's here not ordinary shraddha we are speaking you be careful that here what shraddha actually speaking it's not at all normal shraddha it is decorated with shraddha so definitely we need to understand that that ordinary shraddha it is not a, it is not anushraddha that shraddha ni to means anni to decorated with shraddha it is decorated with shraddha if he is like the shinya shloka mukhar jindu if you are actually hearing from the lotus mode of your guru vaishnav or else you are actually speaking under his guidance that actually she can get shuddha bhakti bhakti eh yes they can get shuddha bhakti definitely bhakti param bhagavate pratilokya ka ridrog ma shupainati ridrog hriday ka jo kaam hai that kind of kama there inside your heart what the some smell is there of that kama or desire ridrog ma shu ma shu mani immediately ma shu means that immediately that all those uh, normal comfortable people those who are stable for that actually it is written but for sahajyas they are not at all uh, understanding this point at all that sahajya acharya they are not at all thinking shraddhan vitam first is spoken and after that anushi nivan shri nivan after that varna ekyam bhaktim param bhagavatim भगवान चरण में अनन्य प्रेम भक्ति लाभ करें टॉप मोस्ट परिमय भक्ति और लोटस गेट ऑफ कृष्ण दैट अनन्य भक्ति वी नीड टू अटेन खूब जल्दी और धीर बन जाए जो उसका विषय का चाहत उत्पटान कुछ नहीं है बिकॉज़ हिज एक्चुअल कंसंट्रेशन रिगार्डिंग दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड इज नॉट एट ऑल ऑपोजिट it is totally straight forward towards that transcendental absolute truth so das goswami so das goswami pad he wants to speak here that inhone bola that he is speaking big vyakti ke liye that for vigya person that shruti smriti all actually is written there har kisi ka ghar 
for each and every kind of garment a garment that kind of work which is actually divided that swarup gyan which is getting manifested inside the heart that that already it is being done for that they are not all speaking the shastra which are like this at all why because for these people that shuti shuti gan etc atmarati krishna rati and pure seva instructions are given for those people for these people and in the shutis that atmarati krishna rati and is actually categorized in shuddha seva that all the shraddhalu persons that was full of shraddha that kind of facilities they can get regarding shuddha bhakti and goswami pad goswami prabhu that for what thing that by not at all attaining as dharma pri- dharma pratishti that that's why goswami pad he is speaking to all those people that speaking about that dharma and adharma that differentiation without telling that by not at all attaining all these kind of things that yugal sarkar that seva is giving us this kind of instructions regarding that which is more practical by rejecting all kind of dharma and adharma in the life of all those sadaks in the life of all those sadaks that uh, that topmost proj prayojniya uh, work that prayojniya tatv that different different kinds of in the life of the sadaks different different kinds of that essential prayojniya work that will be there then this all definitely it should be get connected with that yugal service it means that ultimately that for the satisfaction of yugal sarkar it should be done so what other can be the actual aim that in varna varna ashram varna ashram nishth situation that we have to get on to that bhagavat seva platform definitely we have to achieve that that varna ashram nishtha up till what point it is necessary when you are not at all attaining that paramhans stage up till that point that paramhans stage is not at all there that is very much necessary up till that point that varna ashram nishth you understand the point that varna ashram nishth that varna ashram nishth who is there so ye varna so this varna ashram nishth that kind of situation condition that is very much important to think that varna ashram in varna ashram nishth situation varna and ashram just by accepting that only and only aim is to just satisfy bhagwan otherwise that what is the actual meaning of varna ashram varna ashram no use of that at all the varna ashram is not at all of any use at all so that's why varna ashram nishth situation that according to the rules and regulation we need to go that varna ashram dharma who is actually not at all applicable on that on whom that varna ashram dharma won't be get applicable we, we cannot get applicable that varna ashram dharma only on paramhans that paramhans pe- persons there is no rules and regulations for them why because they are actually drive, driven and controlled by prema krishna prema that's why a lot of times i have already described this and discussed it in front of you that all these points that varnashram in the varnashram stage that bhagwan shri krishna speaking to uddhav that is actually all those paramans uh, devotees so varnashram dharma varnashram dharma is the situation that what is written in the vedas that all kind of uh, work or activities you can do or you can do but you have to become seva mai towards yugal kishor seva it's not like that ved ved kar veda that karm in the vedas it is becoming uh, opposite to our krishna seva 
that varnashram nisht situation that what is actually written in the vedas what activities different kind of activities you need to perform but that should get uh, connected with that uh, bhagavat seva that those who are actually griha that kind of money power family you not know, to maintain their family <coughs> all kind of maintenance of their family and your own body that should be the actual get connected with the bhagavat seva that is the actual work of bhagwan to do all this kind of maintenance work this kind of uh, uh, thing you just need to uh, activate that that we do only have to become the servant of the servant of bhagwan that we just need to identify ourselves as the servant of servant of bhagwan and whatever kind of uh, result of any kind of activity what you are performing that kind of atma sat to remain atma sat is very much uh, is not at all good at all whatever kind of karma you are do that definitely you need to perform and do that uh, actual karma what you are doing activities it will not at all allow you to do atma atma sat with bhagwan at all if it is not at all diverted and diverted towards bhagwat seva whatever kind of karma fall you are getting that is all should get uh, surrendered onto the lotus feet of bhagwan for bhagwat seva in hari bhakti vilas also that shraddha et cetera that just by doing that seva that you just need to do the actual anushthan of that in that under him that in hari bhakti vilas it is written that you just need to do the anushthan by doing the bhagwat seva if bhagwat seva if someone is doing bhagwat seva and he wants to do something that if some shraddha is there definitely he will ask seva only if no shraddha is there that he is becoming varnashram dharma in uh, that situation he is actually quitting that then for him there is no question of him at all then no kind of problem will be there for him that what mahaprabhu ji ma that what mahaprabhu in the siddhant vichar in his siddhant vichar it's already coming like this shraddha means that to do seva that kind of uh, mood you are having to do seva and varnashram dharm is actually applicable up till that when sadak he is in not at all coming on to that parmas platform let i'll give you one example shila sachidanand bhakti no thakur he is actually a prakrit eternal parshad of gorang mahaprabhu but still the leela what he is doing here on this material planet that he already gone into that grast uh, grast platform and have doing every kind of job also but but he is not at all getting engaged or entangled in all this at all even he has done he mo- one uh, wife was gone but again he has to marry because uh, who actually will maintain all the other people because his uh, his district magistrate no he has his job so who will actually maintain his child and family so again he has to marry so externally you can see that topmost grasti he is but from inside if you can see that he is paramhans that all the time he is is paramhans he is writing and uh, hearing and speaking what not bhakti mun thakur has done shila sachidan bhakti mun thakur all things of gaudiya what we are getting is because of bhakti mun thakur as if gaudiya mat gaudiya mat and bhakti mun thakur is uh, uh, equivalent to bhakti mun thakur that who what is gaudiya mat that is bhakti mun thakur so much siddhant vichar wave of siddhant vichar given by bhakti mun thakur lekin but when at last at when retirement was done and he was actually taking paramans wish from jagannath das baba ji maharaj then he already was paramans from previous he already was previously paramans that he is previous already in paramans stage they are beyond any rules all those uh, paramhans bhakti no thakur that external vesh may be uh, red cloth nothing is required because he is paramhans from inside it 
he is eternally that he has that paramount uh, platform already is there shila gaur kishor das baba ji maharaj how he has shown us when varnashram nishta that is you have to leave that then then that swarupato bravas that yugal seva will become natural that when national dharma nishta automatically will uh, go away and swarupata brajvas that yugal seva service of yugal kishor that naturally will get uh, automatically manifest inside your heart for those people that kind of uh, braj if they are just uh, living in other uh, place then they have to mentally serve braj dham then they have to mentally serve braj dham what to do no point they have to do mental seva of braj dham if they are not staying at braj physically they have to do mental seva mentally they have to serve what uh, they can do apart from that okay okay mentally he is actually having brajvas so shuti gano nirukto dharmo ba adharma kuch karne ke liye no nothing is there no dharma neither dharma nor adharma that to get, nobody can save you from the life of cycle of birth and death of this karma paribhavar na bojale tori vaade na dekhi upayo kitna sundar very nice kirtan you can see that aur and kya hai what's written here that's what's written in dharma and adharma written in the shutis it's all actually being uh, will become one kind of bondage for all of you and the second number that shila sachinandan that to shri sachinandan nandan nandan krishna you just need to think like that lot of uh, proofs are there regarding that lot of proofs are there where i can give you proofs lot of proofs are there lot of proofs are there that uh, definitely we will just uh, discuss next week that same sachinandan is that sachinandan who is actually nandan nandan sachinandan and uh, nandan nandan there is no difference between them at all that gurudev that we are speaking mukund prest we just need to respect gurudev as mukund prest that all jugal parichardya ka sarva that uh, yugal parichardya seva it's all are written Uh, all the time that yugal kishor 24/7 you just need to engage in the bhagavad seva all the time they are actually if you will not at all engage then definitely that parmarth siddhi in the bhajan raj it's impossible to get that shri sachinandan that independent uh, uh, worship of the shri sachinandan that that kind of non different uh, knowledge of uh, with krishna will not at all stay at all you understand the point what i'm speaking that shri sachi nandar if you are actually worshiping independently shri shri sachi nandan then with krishna that kind of non difference with krishna that kind of knowledge will definitely won't be there at all it won't stay at all that just by having that difference and non difference uh, that kind of knowledge at the time of worshiping shri krishna just uh, all the time that if you are having that difference of knowledge that shri krishna worship at the time of worshiping shri krishna that kind of uh, remembrance and anusrita definitely will uh, stay there and mukund prest means that our guru maharaj gurudev that they are very much dear and near to the devotees and they are his own eternal parshad my guru dev that about that it is written humko 
that we, in order to get deliver us that Shri Krishna, just for our deliverance, that Shri Gurudev actually has been uh, uh, given for our deliverance, that kind of realization should be there for the us. That kind of realization definitely should be there. Srimati Radhika Rani is Priya Sakhi. That Srimati Radhika Rani is that Priya Sakhi is our Gurudev. If we are thinking him as his Priya Sakhi of Sri Radhika, our Gurudev, then that very, our vichar will become very beautiful. Otherwise, then definitely there will be problem. All the time, 24-7, 24 hours, that Bhagwan, that dearer and nearer Seva of Bhagwan, who all the time are engaged in that, that is actually Gurudev, who is all the time engaged in uh, Yugal Kishore Seva. Just for our deliverance, Bhagwan Shri Krishna is actually coming in the form of Gurudev in front of us. That kind of realization definitely should be there. That Srimati Radhika, Srimati Radha Nari Priya Namra Sakhi, that Gurudev, we just need to understand that. So what actually being spoken here? So like this kind of vichar, Srila Das Goswami Pad has just uh, upfronted that in front of us, that Srila Das Goswami Pad has presented in front of us. It is very easy to speak externally, but to just practically follow it is very much difficult. So you can see that Sakshat Parat Parakhireshwar, that Infinity Brahmanda Nayak, that Karuna Varanalai, that this Bhagwan Shri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he what he has done actually. That I'll give you two to four examples regarding this. Then only you can understand that Shri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu about him. That, uh, that what Sanskrit Kirtan in that it is written, what it's written there in the Sanskrit Kirtan, what is written in the Sanskrit Kirtan, that Prabhu just by presenting his Acharya in front of us, he's showing us that how we have to do bhajan, Bhavan himself actually doing Acharya and just showing us. And you tell what is required for Bhagwan to just show that Acharya, he swam Bhagwan himself. He is Swam Bhagwan himself. That what kind of thing is required for him to show us? That uh, still he is actually just for an example. He is actually Mahaprabhu actually showing us his own Acharan. That what is required for him? But still by Acharan he is actually showing us Mahaprabhu. That's why Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. This Sanskrit Kirtan, in that it is written. What actually written there? That all, in order to just teach all the jivas, that Bhagwan is actually doing all this. Sri 
all in order to just teach us bhagwan actually doing in order to teach us bhagwan actually is doing that so uh, definitely nothing is required for bhagwan but still mahaprabhu actually showing in his own acharan that that how in the vedas inside vedas different different kind of vichar what is there in the vedas that in order to just uh, leave that and bhagwan actually is uh, showing us that actual pathway of prema he segregated that pathway by showing the actual pathway of prema what actually written here that for his devotees inside the heart of the devotees that we should that 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 kind of cleverness of bhajan that technique of actual bhajan shuddha bhajan that in order to instruct that in front of us that bhagwan actually just getting avir bhav in front of us that swayam who is actually avatari himself you will say actually it is clear so bhagwan shri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu by his own wish he is actually doing the leela of devotees that bhagwan that whole leela if you carefully analytically making a vichar then you can very easily see there notice that that mostly bhagwan shri krishna chaitanya actually is doing the leela of devotees and after that when you go in the navadvip leela that about bhagavata also is actually indicating that but when he is coming into a normal stage then bhagwan speaking that i have done something you that i am doing something wrong no 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 prabhu you haven't done anything wrong then bhagwan don't uh, prabhu don't remember that because shri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu exactly he is just like a human being he is actually doing the leela just like human leela he is actually doing that eating drinking sleeping and everything he is doing that why that if that kind of sweetness of leela will definitely go away it won't stay that anand of sweetness of leela it will go away if bhagwan taking very different kind of weapons and doing magic all the time shoo like this you just die like this that on bhagwan that uh, kind of human like uh, uh, mind that preeti prem won't be stay with bhagwan at all if bhagwan won't be to him if the cow can love a cow if the cow can call love cow then the bull can love a bull it can be possible it is possible sajati sajati that uh, only one uh, kind of desire that only one uh, uh, goal is there of bhajan Who, who will be doing association with whom in english there is one saying it's already written there no lots of lot of proofs are there lot of proofs you can see here that cow can do the association with cow the horse will do association with horse like this is the rules only so this is only rules no that 
those who are like that he will be doing association with that that the actual thief the cheater fraudster they will do sadhu sang you are thinking <laughs> they will all do drama that's it it is not at all possible at all not at all possible so mashri vim shriman mahaprabhu himself uh, seeing help himself showing us that ragunath das was speaking that this is not a new thing at all that shriman mahaprabhu himself showing us a human leela that bhagwan shri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu that in his own life in his own leela what is manifesting that especially what he has shown in his leela and what kind of vichar and siddhant he is speaking and what his acharan he has done all mahaprabhu uh, this is actually one kind of uh, instructions of mahaprabhu that shriman mahaprabhu's instructions that kind of instructions in the in the in the in the granth of goswami is everything is written there about the instructions of shriman mahaprabhu if you are actually thinking it rightly then if you are actually uh, thinking in an absolute way if you are thinking in it in an absolute way all are the exact explanation of the teaching of sri chaitanya mahaprabhu sikha aur jyada kya batao and what uh, else i need to speak to you what more i can speak all books written by goswami all are the exact explanation and uh, the actual uh, instructions of the shriman mahaprabhu that is the uh, conclusion is there and i will i'll also give examples regarding this more so that you can understand that misconception won't come in your life regarding instructions of mahaprabhu you will think that so much time mahaprabhu ji shriman mahaprabhu even lot of times he man mahaprabhu this vichar of the vedas that the actual in depth vichar of the vedas by that apart from that he man mahaprabhu he is actually respecting prema that's why you can see shri nath chakravarti pad already writing bhagavan vijasthane astadhyam vrindavanam ramma kachidu vasana prajapati vargena ya kalpita श्रीमद भागवतम प्रमाण ममलम प्रेमा कुमार तुमानो श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभुर मतम इदम तत्तादरना प्रेम की जो बात है दैट द ऑल द ऑल सिद्धांत ऑफ ऑफ भागवत जी महापुराण एंड प्रेमा दैट द प्रेमा इज द टॉप मोस्ट पॉइंट वी नीड टू गेट दैट इज द टॉप मोस्ट एम कृष्ण प्रेम दैट इज द एक्चुअल सिद्धांत ऑफ श्रीमद महाप्रभु दैट श्री that all those sahajiyas that according in the bhagavat parampara they are not at all understanding that at all and they are all thinking uh, all in fighting with mantra parampara they are thinking of what you have godiam what godiam it is having you come foolish number 1 to me they are all number 1 foolish what i can do they don't want to understand at all even one red cloth so much kind of uh, nuisance they are actually spreading that to whom i will speak i also have to make one voice uh, of that book what i can do what i can do you tell me all foolish actually sanyas shri man mahaprabhu ji has told sanatan ji ne has already told this already written A foolish number one him ma shri man mahaprabhu himself who is parat par ekheleshwar he is actually taking red cloth ha huh? and madhavendra puri pad ishwar puri pad brahmanand bharti who not not taking red cloth you tell me sanyas cloth swarup gosai also so it's actually prohibited all foolishness what is the reason no body no guru is there that in there all the sahajiya no guru is there at all no guru is there if guru is there then definitely he'll give the description they are not at all giving description all foolishness is going on all rubbishness whole material whole world actually is just uh, uh, getting uh, engaged in this foolishness and they are just giving them opposite instructions 
that Godiamat is is giving Janeu that what you have done. They are giving Godiamat is giving sacred thread. It's already written in Shastras. It's already written that what Prabhupada ji has done according to the Shastras he has done. He is not doing on his own at all. Whether Gaur Mantra, Panchatattva is there, Gaur Gaitri, everything that from Sri Chaitanya Upanishad I have already published that that for foolish people it hasn't gone I think all in all the hands of Sahajyas they don't want to understand so foolish they are that this Tridandi Vesh how it can be prohibited you tell me Sridhar Goswami Pad in his comment he's writing he's foolish actually that Sri Jishiman Mahaprabhu already taken all are actually Tridandi a foolish for what purpose it is actually written you just make this vichar that for Vaishnavas that they are actually Sahaj Paramhans on the material Paramhans platform that just in order to give take red cloth and just to introduce themselves they don't need this kind of introduction at all I'll just definitely gonna explain this ahead that for Vaishnav they don't need any kind of introduction they are naturally Paramhans whatever condition they are Bhakti Vinod Thakur that everyone thinking wrong that some Baba actually thinking Bhakti Vinod Thakur wrong some Baba actually just uh, uh, thinking Bhakti Vinod Thakur wrong Are from here he has come no Diksha no Kanthimala nothing no Japa is doing and he is speaking very big big thing and his bhajan totally destroyed his bhajan totally get destroyed Bhagwan has just destroyed his bhajan then at last he is taking lotus feet of Bhakti Vinod Thakur oh Maharaj you just uh, for what purpose you are asking uh, forgiveness for me actually I was thinking wrong about you you have no Guru Diksha that no Kanti Mala nothing you are having and Bhakti Vinod Thakur just started laughing and speaking yes you are right up till now I haven't got any Guru Diksha that you are speaking it right no 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 I actually have thought you wrong that you are the eternal Parshad of Bhagwan himself I thought that he is speaking big big points no Diksha nothing he has taken eh? and he is speaking big big points so you just forgive me please like this he is speaking so that Bhakti Vino Thakur that Diksha is, he has taken one kind of uh, one kind of one kind of uh, uh, so called Diksha he has taken but uh, before that he has written lot of books Gaudiya Vaishnav Siddhant Vichar books before taking the Diksha maybe by the power of Gurudev that disciple can write but Bhakti Vinod Thakur in his life it's all total opposite means it is right for us it's opposite but for Bhakti Vinod Thakur it's bilkul straight so whatever actually is written that no father in the world he can uh, write without the trip of Gurudev because he is eternal Parshad of Bhagwan. that's why he can write that is uh, he is a eternal Parshad you, you thinking that Srila Bhakti Sanat Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada he used to take Diksha huh? he is eternal Parshad automatically he is actually uh, doing everything but still he is showing us if he will not show then opposite will happen so lot of vichar is there where you will go lot of examples I can quote Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has respected them to all the devotees that uh, and to all the Sahajyas if we are actually speaking our uh, this one Maharaj that they are Kundavasi that uh, they that Mahantaji they are actually taking Diksha not to do, not today maybe 20 to 25 years back 25 to 30 years back they paying Dandavat definitely we have to pay Dandavat there like uh, Uddhavji Maharaj paying Dandavat to Duryodhan he is paying Pranam to Duryodhan <laughs> So Maharaj, okay, Dandavat. Okay, what happened? That I want to speak something and they started speaking. And the Mahantri is speaking and Gaudiyamat. How actually they are writing that they are giving sacred thread. Are Maharaj, Gaudiyamat actually is doing wrong that you do speak one thing to us. That Kopin is actually more important or sacred thread is actually more. That Kopin is important. That what to speak of that Kopin is definitely important. So if Kopin is important then uh, for normal person those who are characterless those, those who don't have character for those people that even for one uh, one night they are not at all making their bed pure that you are actually giving coping to them those people so who is actually more at fault you tell me whether Gaudiya is at fault 
और यू आर एट फॉल्ट है यू आर गिविन कॉपी स्ट्रेट अवे जय शीला संत गोस्वामी महाराज हिमसल यूज टू स्पीक दिस पॉइंट दैट कॉपी इन धारी सन्यासीज इफ फॉर इवन वन नाइट दे आर एक्चुअली जस्ट मिस यूजिंग दैट कॉपी इन दैट संत गोस्वामी महाराज स्पीक दे नीड टू थ्रो दैट कॉपी इन दैट आवर संत गोस्वामी महाराज यूज टू स्पीक दिस If they can't maintain their purity of that copine for one day, that they need to that so much purity you need to maintain. You need to throw that copine. And he's speaking opposite that sacred thread, this which are already is there in the shastras. That Bhagwan Shri Krishna, this uh, external which are he is actually taking uh, birth in Vaishya family. And if we are thinking Mathura, he that is Shatriya. That he is taking sacred thread. So what is the fault in that? You tell me. Ha? He is actually Brahman Dev, Swayam. That he is actually for all the things. That is the actual major thing. That for all the cause actually is coming from him only. So then you actually want to just hang everyone in a court. supreme court and everywhere what you want actually said this all actually he is the cause of all the causes definitely you will hang him also govind <laughs> what you will do that sacred thread is natural natural thing to give that in manu samhita also in varadra samhita lot of places actually it is mentioned there this is definitely important that brahman theek hai so what we can do lekin ye log samajh but they are not at all understanding they are thinking that propad has not at all given overnight isko they are brahman banana that he is making not for making overnight brahman propad giving sacred thread propad giving this vichar that you see hari bhajan is a very far distant thing for all all of those hari bhajan is a very far distant thing that brajvas is also one speaking one kind of song gokul nagari to bada dur ki baat hai this is very far distant thing at least you do one thing kam se kam to at least you do one thing that you are doing the seva of temple so for that initially minimum that quality of brahman you need to maintain that definitely that kind of acceptance should be there in your life to maintain uh, brahman qualities Raupa not at all uh, nightly is not at all uh, overnight is not making brahman but at least that kind of brahmanism should be there minimum uh, that uh, to become vaishnav is a far distant thing that is very dis- far distant thing to do hari bhajan that brajvas is also speaking this kirtan gokul nagari bare dur nagari eh you are actually singing no this dur nagari gokul nagari bare dur <laughs> that i started laughing and <laughs> definitely i speaking right that birth after birth someone actually waiting maybe krishna can just take me to gokul so nice you see this bhava of prajavasis very far distant thing but at least that the quality of brahman should be there because inside vaishnavas that krishna bhakti krishna gun sakali sanchar that inside krishna devotees that they have the treasure of all the kind of qualities inside them you understand the point that uh, that uh, top most krishna devotee inside him that he has the treasure of all the kind of different uh, qualities that what krishna is having every quality is there in the devotees except that kind of creation process and ras leela etc all that they don't have eligibility that venu madhuri roop madhuri gun madhuri gun madhuri can be there but venu madhuri roop madhuri can't be there like krishna it can be but all those characteristics in bhagwan that is actually that creator that kind of creation maintenance and destruction of this material world that parat parakileshwar bhagwan shri krishna he is there that inside him that kind of special qualities what is there that to do maintenance creation and destruction of creation that kind of qualities in the devotees it is it can't be there but apart from that whatever other qualities are there in krishna definitely it will present inside the devotees krishna bhakti krishna gun sakali sanchar ye to bol 
that already been spoken all actually been written there so what a kind of uh, bad thing is there you tell me so at least that kind of brahmanical so this that brahman actually is having the 12 qualities all these 12 qualities that these 12 qualities that bright brahman that more and more prominent is that those who are actually taking birth in a very low caste family but still they are actually doing bhajan of bhagwan he is a devotee of bhagwan that brahman that he is actually away from that bhagwat charan then have definitely is useless those who are actually just uh, taking a dog flesh now they are actually doing bhajan of bhagwan like ohak chandal like ohak chandal shabri mother shabri so they are actually all these examples are there by this which are we can understand a normal person can't understand all this at all normal person can't understand that shiman mahaprabhu that in his own leela he is making this vichar only that vichar he has already shown that shiman mahaprabhu he hasn't shown what what is actually written shri chatanj chitamre mahaprabhu is speaking to haridas thakur oh haridas where are you where are you you just call we will take prasadam all together then haridas thakur actually just in the road he is in the haridas actually mahaprabhu asking you to come inside that you just request prabhu that i don't have this kind of capacity to just come inside that i can come and have take prasadam there i am actually will be staying outside and i will be taking darshan of prabhu outside only and mahaprabhu actually thinking that he actually haridas thakur that he is in his life that kind of adarshan etiquette he has shown that kind of etiquette will just be the top most etiquette for all all the persons that what sanatan and rup goswami path for them to get into jagannath mandir is prohibited for them you tell me they are bhardwaj gotra brahmans that you tell me that rup sanatan for them that to get into jagannath temple is actually uh, is uh, prohibited they are actually bhar bhar bhardwaj gotra brahmans that they are so top most brahmans of mysore but still they are actually like muslims that inside muslims in uh, that kind of leela they have already shown that they are under muslim counterpart they are following and they have got association of um, milch association they have done so that's why to get into jagannath temple we don't have uh, we are prohibited to go that even to go inside jagannath temple even sanatan goswami path won't go the main inside the main gate singh dwar that kind of other pathway in order to go there he also stopped there to go one time mahaprabhu speaking that sanatan goswami path coming from the ocean oceanic pathway so much very much hot sand is there and is out of that he is actually just running and coming to mahaprabhu and mahaprabhu is actually is param swayam bhagwan he is speaking that sanatan from which pathway you come that i have taking this kind of uh, oceanic pathway why you came from this oceanic pathway you can come from the straight pathway this is a very nice pathway actually maharaj actually i can't from the come from there why because if i will come there then if i can just uh, one panda if some panda will touch me will just get the if some that's uh, will get some touch of me then definitely i will do aparadh that mahaprabhu thinking that so much become happy so much mahaprabhu became happy that you can't even imagine that that in order to uh, man- manifest that topmost acharan that mahaprabhu himself in the form of devotees that he also has just accepted the actual uh, acharan of the devotees like haridas thakur is not at all uh, bringing inside that okay if it will become one idealism and example okay he can do like that said inside every person that definitely false ego is there i am actually very big i am here i am dig this post but at least he can uh, just think like this no but okay whatever mahaprabhu actually is actually understanding that 
what they are doing and if you are making an external vichar internal and external vichar then that one chota haridas thakur he is not at all accepting him and chota haridas mahaprabhu not accepting him and he also mahaprabhu he is just throwing him in such a condition that he actually taking the he is taking the plea of the lotus feet of mahaprabhu in order to get the nitya seva of bhagwan at triveni sangam in allahabad he has just uh, uh, leaving his body this is actually suicide no it's not suicide at all just to have that uh, to get the seva of bhagwan he is actually doing that no kind of uh, problem is there if someone actually told that okay no 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 you just stay here why are you going away what you have done prabhu that very normal thing it is you just uh, for, forgive him but mahaprabhu not all speaking like that at all so all this this dharma avatar sakshat that dharma in order to uh, honor in order to place that dharma to manifest that dharma that uh, paratpara kaleshwar sri sachinandan is getting manifested is lila here and you can see like the devotee is like sanatan goswami is speaking that he has came from the sand and lot of boils has just coming on to his feet but still mahaprabhu become so much satisfied and not at all speaking to him at all okay let him do whatever he wants but mahaprabhu can say why from tomorrow you can this is my instruction from this path you have to come mahaprabhu thinking that okay this kind of other she wants to show they so much trinadapi uh, bhav humble mood that will become one kind of idealism in this material world definitely we have that false ego inside us so that mahaprabhu has accepted this kind of siddhant what sanatan ko swami which is not at all uh, good to accept but still he accepted and you can see the case of vallabhacharya also that vallabhacharya has taken a birth in so big uh, brahman family and mahaprabhu respecting him in arail gram at the bank of triveni and this same vallabhacharya when he is actually speaking that she the swami pad that commentary what he has written i won't not accept that they definitely there is one fault it is not is useless then mahaprabhu become very unhappy what kya bataate ho what you want to speak that shridhar goswami pad jiska bare mein that about him in the shastras it's already written that who is getting the full grip of nirsingh dev you are speaking him is useless that same shridhar swami pad you are actually is actually uh, disrespecting him hai so much acharya is bhag big bhagwat acharya is and you are disrespecting him i hope you go away mahaprabhu speaking to him jinka himmat hai that who has this kind of false ego that they are not respecting their own husband just by not accepting their husband this kind of courage is there definitely i am actually getting them into the list of prostitutes i am actually getting them in the list of prostitutes and ballavajare just stopped all the dharma avatars whatever is there dharma sanstapana ayu that kind of prasamayo itarasya cha aur gita mein bhi and in gita also it is written what actually written there that same thing is written in gita as well that in that this mahaprabhu is actually speaking how we are doing that you have this kind of audacity that you are speaking that shridhar swami pad you are not at all you are not accepting shridhar swami pad that who is not at all accepting his own husband that kind of courage is not that he is actually prostitute then vallabha jare start stopped talking prakit kavi that you see that that you can see the one one another example that uh, a material poet is actually uh, writing one kind of poetry and uh, shriman mahaprabhu don't feel not at all feeling to hear that and nowadays this is the same process someone actually speaking something someone is actually speaking they all foolishness is writing and is actually writing and publishing and we will be accepting that now this is the condition definitely must have written it right so in any how that siddhant vichar that all this which are nothing is there all actually is getting jabki chaitanya chaitamitra gone away maybe it's written chaitanya charitamrita ya hoite kisne lage sudhira mano 
that Siddhant just don't make uh, that kind of uh, uh, so much dizziness in by uh, having that Siddhant Vichar always be active out Siddhant Vichar it, it's written in Shri Chaitanya Jirtamrit then you can see afterwards that some person uh, is speaking to the Prabhupada some person speaking to the Prabhupada and Maharaj that this is a very big sadhu and uh, very nice sadhu he is but uh, he don't know about Siddhanta at all the Prabhupada speaking it is not at all possible that those who are actual sadhu real sadhu their Siddhanta which are automatically will be there maybe he can't give pravachan but uh, he don't have that practice to give pravachan but he's a big sadhu he don't have any Siddhanta which are it's impossible it's next to impossible can't be there at all big sadhu means definitely that Siddhanta definitely will be there that Siddhant Vichar and, uh, and uh, that kind of uh, topmost, uh, it is all interrelated to each other. And he, if Siddhant Vichar is not there, it becomes a big sadhu, it can't be possible at all. He all interrelated to each other. He is a big sadhu and no Siddhant is there, not at all possible at all. How it is possible, you tell me. It is not at all possible. And if you make this Vichar again, that Sriman Mahaprabhu, lot of uh, activities he has done uh, by that that whole material world that kind of uh, all the cheaters and fraudsters of this material world they are actually speaking all rubbish and opposite preaching they are doing they are actually just putting one uh, doubt on Mahaprabhu that Mahaprabhu is actually just breaking all the caste and creed everything kind of dharma it's already written in Gita he, but Mahaprabhu actually has just destroyed everything and just uh, of this uh, Varnashram dharma that kind of uh, doubt and suspicion they created about Sriman Mahaprabhu definitely that they are more than demons and asuras that I am actually thinking that they are actually more than asuras and demons. They are more fallen than the uh, beast. That kind of uh, uh, disrespect they are putting on Mahaprabhu. That suspicion they are putting that Mahaprabhu has actually destroyed all the Varnashram Dharma. You see, <laughs> who actually has spoken that? Who has spoken that? You tell me. You just show me that. You show me the actual proof regarding that. That in Varanasi Mahaprabhu gone. That in order to just uh, settle that actual dharma, Bhagavad dharma, that the uh, persons will be thinking that in order to make it on the right track, that in Varanasi what Mahaprabhu has done, what Sriman Mahaprabhu has done, in the house of Tapan Mishra, he has taken the, uh, arranged the prasadam, and in and Chandrasekhar Acharya, he is actually Shudra, definitely Vaishnam is not Shudra, he is more than Brahman, but still Mahaprabhu, in, in his house he has stayed, and he is taking prasadam there, so much examples I can give you. When, when uh, Mahaprabhu just went to Mathura at Adi Keshav temple, when one uh, Vaishnav, he is actually meeting with one Vaishnav, Sanoriya Brahman. Sanoriya Brahman actually asking him that Gosain, that with me, that you have some connection with Madhavendra Puri. It looks like that uh, Mahaprabhu speaking, yes, I have. When they are getting the actual uh, communication, then they started hugging each other and loving them. And they are speaking that I actually want to give you one kind of uh, uh, invitation, but nobody taking prasadam in my side because I am from a very low caste family. I am Sanoriya Brahman. That who that kind of water, it will not at all eligible for anyone to take prasadam. But uh, Madhavendra Puri Pad is my Gurudev who has just come to me. That Gurudev, he has taken some prasadam to my house. Are Guru Gurudev taking prasadam in your house? Definitely, I will also take. Are no, 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 Mahaprabhu. That if everyone will, the whole disrespect will be there for you. Okay, let it be done. Okay, let my disrespect be done. No worries. That our Guru work, what I have, they have done, that definitely I also have to follow that. So you see that at one point Mahaprabhu's vichar is there at one point. How you just need to get the topmost Prem Bhava that in the life of Mahaprabhu very nice, nice vichar is there. You see. And after that uh, another point is actually is written. 
very less time we are having i can't speak more uh, because actually today is rath yatra this uh, already that rath yatra is but still i am actually taking the time to speak that's that's why just i just giving this pravachan i am just getting mentally to puri now <laughs> so this kind of four months from megal the devotees are coming and pratap rudra is actually just standing there and just by taking the actual introduction of devotees that who who what is the name of whom that i have just heard of each and every one but i haven't seen it physically then king pratap rudra with him that our sarvam bhattachari is standing and kashi mishra he is a top most raj pandit that raj guru he actually just standing on the rooftop and he is speaking that that he is actually or that gosai oh so much power he is actually having who is he that is of dud nitanand gosai oh so nice eh? and after getting so much introduction that all kind of flower garland and everything he is actually giving that on to their neck after just giving the flower garland on their neck ma prabhu ji to the devotee is actually speaking that you do one thing that immediately you immediately you go to the ocean and there you take path and after that immediately you come back again again immediately came back to take prasadam and now the king actually getting this doubt how what how speaking mahaprabhu i actually thought that when you are coming into some kshetra that in order to that he is actually swayam bhagwan that sarva bhattacharya think speaking that he can't be wrong at all he can't be wrong at all he is swayam bhagwan sarva bhattacharya speaking then why actually he is doing like this he is speaking to the devotees that uh, according to the vedas the actual rules of the vedas the actual instruction of the vedas that to come in the kshetra that bhagwan when someone is coming to the kshetra of bhagwan that just uh, to take uh, to do fasting in that kshetra when you are coming then that day you have to do fast and you have to just uh, bald off your head and uh, remove your hair and to do darshan of bhagwan is important but he is actually speaking that go taking the uh, taking bath in the ocean and take prasadam are at least you must be must have told that you go to the temple of jagannath take darshan and take prasadam what he is speaking it's not good this siddhant is not good then this kind of doubt and suspicion he is actually just manifested that in front of uh, sarvam bhattacharya that is doubts and suspicion what king pratap rudra was having he actually manifested that are how actually this point is there that i have seen that he is parat parakleshwar swayam bhagwan he is yes he is so how he can speak that according his own vichar what is written in the veda he is broke that what about what that why he is actually speaking here that you go to the ocean and after taking bath you take prasadam whether it is not the rules that to take fasting and to just remove your hairs and to take darshan of jagannath that just by removing all this what mahaprabhu speaking then after that sarvam bhattacharya at that point sarvam bhattacharya is speaking that rajan oh rajan you just hear this point what i'm speaking that oh rajan hear this that what you are speaking definitely is vidhi marg that all the vedas we have to follow the instructions of vedas according to that and what you are actually seeing that is actually the actual prem marg that vidhi marg it is more and more topmost than vidhi marg at so much topmost that even in a dream also you can't even imagine that that is vidhi marg this is rag marg rag marg in rag marg those two to four uh, uh, rules are actually broken also then there is no disadvantage in that especially shri chaitanya mahaprabhu swayam that in his hand that he is giving some parivesan to other prasadam he is giving prasadam to others doing parivesan to the devotees that so much kind of prema is there that apart from that who will actually do fasting if <laughs> if someone actually giving this suggestion that who will do fasting that after doing fasting then you will this kind this kind of sukriti or good deeds you will get and there shri chandan mahaprabhu himself standing and with prasadam that who will what you will do you tell me there shri chandan mahaprabhu is there and there all those brahmans all rules are there what i will follow that i will that 
all i will break all the rules and regulations of the brahman throw it away and go towards mahaprabhu that will be my decision why because so much love is there that prem that sakshat parat parikeshwar bhagwan himself swayam rup bhagwan that is not avatar he himself is avatar that he actually instructing directly that uh, the actual instructions of the vedas bhagwan speaking indirect adesh indirect instructions of mine and shri chaitanya mahaprabhu who ved punan upanishad who has manifested that that he is speaking himself that you go to the ocean and take bath and just go take prasada so this is one is indirect instruction one is direct instruction so so direct instruction we need to accept that in the niti shastra also nyay shastra niti shastra this actually written there already in the niti shastra also this uh, by one example i am actually speaking so that you can understand that like you understand that arjun just by taking in front arjun bhagwan slowly steadily that karma arpan everything gyan yog dhyan yog rajasur yog everything he is speaking and at last bhagwan at last what he is speaking so so where we have to go you tell me like uh, as you that as you are growing the instructions what mahaprabhu actually mahar bhagwan has given to arjun it's not for arjun all those instructions that this same point he is actually instructing krishna is instructing to uddhav ji maharaj where there in the antim updesh last updesh last instructions of uddhav to uddhav ji maharaj you are actually speaking all the kind of vedic rules regulations achar acharan that you actually thinking that definitely i'm going to go to hell if i will leave them no uddhav that whatever previously the initially what i have told you about dharma if you think that it is for you then i will become very sad it is not for you at all but that i have already given you on to a lap that who will be asking what you just need to give it accordingly and at last that prem bhakti is the topmost that so much i am this vichar i am actually speaking it's not for you but they are actually giving it in your lap so that according to the person's creed like my mayavad vedant i definitely don't want to read that mayavad vedant but still i actually have to understand the vichar if some mayavad is speaking then definitely i have to speak the vichar if some sahajya is there that i have already uh, th- taking their two to four books where the ghost is <laughs> where the ghost is in their books that i definitely have to find it out to rectify that so that's why i'm actually seeing that arjun arjun just by taking in front in geeta it's lot of vichar ma uh, krishna is speaking and all everything is just by taking arjun in front by each and every sanskar different different persons are there and in different different kind of sanskars are there for different persons and each and every sanskar person there is different kind of doors open for them but what is the actual pathway for arjun that if someone actually speaking in this maharaj that uh, i am actually before first day one day before i have told this but that what actually spoken before it will just go de- detasteful detested and the actual that should be given topmost priority the other uh, which are given the before which are that is the actual point the other 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 than that nothing is there so shri chaitanya mahaprabhu that that he speaking that you take prasadam you take some bath in ocean and then you take prasadam so externally it looks that shriman mahaprabhu that according to shruti vedas he is actually not at all obeying that he is going against the instruction of shruti and vedas definitely it looks but still it they, he hasn't why because this is the actual pathway of prema this is the actual pathway of prema that is the actual pathway of prema what mahaprabhu has shown this is not all vidhi mark that is rag mark that is actually rag mark that shri chaitanya mahaprabhu is not at all doing wrong at all so that's why our shri chaitanya mahaprabhu that kind of uh, topmost dearer and nearer raghunath das goswami bad that who has got the topmost love of shriman mahaprabhu that if he has also written then definitely he must have written it right shruti gana niruktam kilapuru 
ब्रजे राधा किशन प्रचुर परिचार जामी हो तनु सची सुनम नंदीश्वर पति सुदत्ते गुरुवरम मुकुंदो प्रेष्ठत्ते स्मरमाजस स्मरमाजस परमाजस श्रम ननु मनो मुकुंद प्रेष्ठत्ते स्मरो परम अजस्रम ननु मनो Today, today we will be just giving rest up till this point. Just forgive me for that. I don't have any kind because time is very less. I just need to stop this. So much seva is there. Again, some again English Hari Katha will start, and then after that Bengali Hari Katha will start. Just forgive me. I'll be just uh, uh, stopping here. Dharma prajita kaitava traparam nirma saranam satam. वेद्यांबास्तवमात्रो वस्तु शिवदम तपोत्तय उन्मूलन श्रीमद्भागवते महामुनिकृत किंबापरेश्वर शो हृदय अवरुद्धतिअु कृतिशुस्तत्न वाचकुश कि पतितानंद पावन भो वैष्णव्यो नम